kind of strike you? Yeah, like, man. Uh, that's, that's tough because, you know, um, for a lot of guys on our team, some of them weren't even born then. You know what I mean? And so for me, uh, like I was 10 years old, and I remember that. I remember being at school and everything. So uh, it's tough. And then playing here my first two years, knowing how much uh, that event impacted the city. Uh, my grandparents and my parents were here for the last home game, and I sent them over to the memorial. You know, So for my grandparents to get a chance to experience that, um, and even my parents, um, it's, it's very emotional and to see those families uh, I think the team does a great job of making sure every player goes over and sees that and understand what they're playing for when they're here. Running in pregame for you know, the families of the Oklahoma City Bounty Makers. Oh, it's amazing. Uh, yeah. Just 10 out of 10, bro. It's just like something unbelievably special. I mean, obviously, uh, Thunder does a good job at kind of showing us the memorial. Yeah. It's, it, yeah. But it's just something different. You know? I mean, it's absolutely great. The memorial does a really good job at, I feel like, paying respect to those who've lost their lives. You know? like they, you know, they're not forgotten. And Thunder does a really good job at keeping them alive in that way. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. So, yeah. It was touching, mate. Just one of those things. Just, you're just, like, shell-shocked. You know, obviously anger comes in straight away as one of the emotions. It's like, why would someone, you know, but, you know, stuff happens. And so that's all I what I remember from it is, you know, how much together the city came. You know what I mean? Like that's the biggest takeaway, especially from the memorial.